Hello everybody, what's going on? It's me again. So if you follow my channel, you would know that I had a great friend who I met a couple of years ago named Molly. She unfortunately passed away a year ago. It's kind of a long story, so feel free to check out the video that I made eight months ago explaining everything. I'll leave a link in the description in the card or whatever you want. But a huge part of that experience was actually going down to Baltimore. Baltimore? That... which... which direction is... But a huge part of that experience was traveling down to Baltimore to attend her funeral service. I still have like a lot of footage from that trip. I originally recorded it because I wanted to make a vlog, but I decided no. So here I am a year later, and I figured around this time would make sense to make a video out of it. So what I'm going to be doing is watching it live and just making a director's commentary over it and see how it goes. So without further ado, let's press the play that press the play button. Say that five times fast. I actually really haven't watched this in almost a year. I remember all of this stuff. I remember I was incredibly scared to like actually go down to Baltimore virtually on my own. What if I get lost? The people I'm staying with are just they are strangers but what if they're like psychopaths that want to kill me or something like you don't honestly you don't like know that this cab driver he was like really cool he was talking to me about like all the people you meet in life they have like their own problems in life and that like even though like you're having a rough day someone else is having an even rougher day and you know and you can't really judge someone based on their actions at that moment like a complete stranger because you don't know what they're going through kind of thing which is like huge, and I, I live like that day to day, pretty much because of what he said to me, you know? I haven't went this far from, from home on my own, so this is definitely new for me. <laughs> they got Wi Fi to a free Wi Fi. They had free Wi Fi on the train. So I took an Uber to Boston South Station. From Boston South Station, I took an Amtrak all the way to New York. I'm on my way to New York, and this guy was my boy. That was Craig. Craig, if you're watching this, you literally are the coolest guy ever. I learned so much from you. That's Craig. That's my boy, man. I just sat next to him on the train, and like after like a half hour, we just started talking and stuff. Man, Craig, Craig. And here I am in New York. This was like not as cool as I expected it to be. Oh man, I just realized I don't have that beanie anymore. I lost that thing. That one was like really comfortable too. It's weird. I remember like all of this stuff. It was like a year later. The funeral was on the 18th last year. Today's 420, blaze it. 420, um, the Tutting in New York video. Check that out if you want. It's up to you. But after that, there was literally nothing to do. All right, so now I'm on the bus. There wasn't that much on the bus. I kind of, I slept actually most of the time, but I do remember there was a very handsome man who sat next to me, and I was very sad. I'm so attractive. <laughs> it's actually funny because in Pennsylvania, when I woke up on the bus, I was at my bus stop. I don't know why, but I was so unbelievably excited about all the silos and the farms that we passed by. Okay, I'm walking oh, yeah. down this pathway into this uh, yellow home. With uh, <laughs> this kid. <laughs> <laughs> I remember that. Uh, he was not about getting recorded, which is okay. It's okay. His house was very nice. It was, he had a very nice house. 42's dad drove us, and he was really cool about it. Like he seemed like he didn't want to drive, but like he knew why we were why we were doing this. So he was very like supportive of all three of us, let alone his son. You know what I mean? Just stare at this car. That car. Oh, that car was cool. No, you don't want to do that here. Oh yeah, I do. <laughs> it's awesome because those two guys were like my first two like ever online friends that like lasted, you know what I mean? It was crazy, like meeting you guys like the three me look at him! That's epic! That's epic! What up epic? Yo, have you seen this dude? Remember this? That's the point of singing. There's what? There's Mary Jones! What up dog? I see you guys! <laughs> you know, that's the worst, that's the easiest song to remember. <laughs> oh man, I love these guys, dude. <laughs> We're going home. We're going home. Oh, is it too much? Just cut it. Just hold on. Oh man. These guys are awesome. They're. Oh man. 
No, no. Yeah. Me, the medium was literally uh, one of yeah. the uh, best experiences uh, of my uh, life, uh, and I will hold that all, here all till I media. die. Epic. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. <laughs> The church was really cool. Um, it was like huge. I'd never been to a Catholic church before, so this is like a whole different thing. We're in Baltimore, and we went all the way to Jersey, which is here now. And then through Jersey, we went all the way to New York, which is up here now. And then from New York, I went back home to Massachusetts, which is here now. My boy P-Dubs picked me up. Thank you, bro, I appreciate it. I don't even think I gave him gas money for this back home. Hey. <laughs> what up, bro? Love you, bro. And I am home. Alright, let's get inside. I want to sleep. Hey, it's 4.20 p.m. on 4.20. Woo! <laughs> to sum it all up in one one word would probably be unforgettable. I actually wear this bracelet, Black for Morning, over Molly and stuff. I'm probably never going to take it off. Anyways, you guys are awesome. If you're at this part of the video, I really appreciate you watching. How about you like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already? How about you guys let me know in the comments what your favorite color is? Because you guys are awesome. I like you guys. I am out of here, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Yeah. Sorry, I gotta get up and stuff. And bye, guys. Watch out.